Okay, are you ready to make taiko bachi out of paper? Paper bachi. So, what you'll need is two grocery bags like this, a pair of scissors, oops, and packaging tape like this. Um, and I like to pre cut it, so you want to have uh, six pieces that are about six inches long and I just cut it and like hang it over the edge of my table like that. So to begin we're gonna just take a paper bag like this and we're gonna cut the bottom off and also if you have the kind paper bag with the handles on it you can just gently rip those handles off because uh, we don't need those. Okay so we're gonna just snip snip cut the bottom of the paper bag off like this and then just turn it around and then cut it from that side like so and then you can just toss that bottom and same thing for this one the other paper bag open one end just like this open one end. so it's open and got this long sheet of paper and then I just want to fold here so this is there's already a big crease there so you just let it fall like that and then we're gonna like fold this in half like this have this part and then this part here. You have it here. And you want to fold that in half like this. So when you fold it, you want to line up just the edge right to that other edge. And then press down. It will create a crease. And now we're going to take, starting from that edge that's been folded, you're going to start to roll it, roll like this, roll the paper, okay? And as you're rolling, you want to squeeze your fingers and twist, 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 so that you're making the roll very tight that way. And you also want to make sure that the edge of the paper is lining up on both sides. test it out make sure it's not too floppy or or, or loosely rolled because uh, if it is then it'll just bend right away so we want it to be somewhat stiff and in order to make it stiff you do need to roll it tightly okay all right so once it's rolled this way you want to hold on to it so it doesn't unravel Take a piece of your pre-cut tape and you want to stick it in the middle like that. And then just wrap it around so that it closes it, so that it keeps it from unraveling. And then take another piece and then you want to do it on the edge, right? Okay, and wrap it around like so. And then finally, I'm going to take one more piece of tape and do it on the other edge. Wrap it around. 
voila! There you have your drumstick. Now I already went ahead and did one with another piece of paper. Same exact procedure. So now I have a pair of paper bachi. Odaiko New England was started by a woman named Elaine Fong. She was a taiko player in New York, and when she moved to Boston, there was no taiko. So she decided to form a group of her own. And that was back in the 90s. Odaiko New England has been around for more than 25 years. Now, what we do is we go around performing at festivals and teaching classes and also doing workshops all around the New England area. And we also go to schools to give programs.